Okay, welcome back. It's Alex from Idea Spot. We have our fifth video in the series. Now, this is the fifth and final one in our fashion website design tutorial. So, we are customizing the contact form. Let's look, have a look at our contact page. Now, we've got our header image and our title. We've got a nice wave divider, um, but we have this contact form. Now, by default, it's not set up to do anything. So, we need to customize the plugin to get this form working. So let's go to our dashboard. I'm gonna open that in a new tab. Now, our form is powered by this plugin called WP Forms. Now, so just click it. It's really easy to customize. The form is called Contact Form by default. Um, hit Edit and loads up our WP Form settings. We want to go to settings and notifications. Now this is all we need to do. Um, if you're happy with your admin email, um, all the forms will just go to whatever that email is or you can put in your own email wherever you like. That doesn't matter as long as that's where you want to receive the form responses from. And the from email is the one that's really important. Um, the from email always needs to come from the same website as you are working on. So this is called style soul comma you. The email must be from the same domain that it's from. Otherwise, places like Gmail, Hotmail, they're going to think um, it's spam if it's not from the place it says it comes from. So let's just call it something like contact at stylesoul.com.au. It doesn't need to be a proper email set up. It's just WordPress needs to identify that it's sending an email from the same place that you've installed it. So um, when you've done that, uh, just hit save. And then your email forms will send to this address and they'll look like they're coming from this address. And that is all there is to it. Um, and then when you fill this in, it will go to that to address and it will say that it's from the from address. Um, the rest of the page is really easy to use. Just click edit with Elementor. Same skills that I showed you in our second video can apply here. You can copy uh, sections, you can add new sections, add new sections from templates and you can just click and customize any of these, get your own email your own phone and put your own contact picture there perhaps um, get rid of that background image under style um, delete that one and add one from your own collection um, but really that's all there is to it um, so that's our contact form all set up and ready to go um, so now you've got your website with its contact form. You've got your headers and footers set up. You've got your blog set up. You can make new blog posts and you can edit any of the other pages in Elementor, add new pages to your menu. Uh, you've really got all the skills you need to build basic websites that look really good. So if this has been helpful in any way, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. I'm going to come out with new videos. Let me know if you've got any ideas in the comments and I will see you next time. Thank you.